I don't like it. It's a ghost ship. Welcome to Jormungand, the world's serpent. An ancient weapon of untold power. This realm is representative of its internal workings. You need only enter and activate the control room to make it yours. Did I activate it? Did I win? I'm sorry, I was so fucking cheesy. Let me go Thor. Mimir, what's happening? Nothing of import detected. Okay, that was just guessing to do that. Mimir, be wary. It is a very large room to have nothing in it. Nothing of import detected. I'm assuming I have to break these. Whoa, cameraman, what the fuck is going on? Soul Assassin, how you doing? Welcome on in. Finally visiting the World Serpent ship. Code Veronic X. I got the power! Round and round. Under 360, sweet. If you have an Xbox One or whatnot, I think it works too. I think. I think for some odd reason it detects it. I'm so grateful that the enemy something up. Also, I was dipping my toes in the pond for uh, Dragon Quest 3. Uh, for those who had some critiques about the characters, how they were designed, that game actually is like a night and day difference. Because it looks like they actually went the SNES style of gameplay with for uh, Dragon Quest 3. I was just kind of looking at it real quick. I couldn't remember if that was one that had the questionnaire, and it did. I was like, all right, this one had the questionnaire. Cool. 
Now seeing how, because it has like that classic vibe to it. Probably. Most USB, ironically, some USB controllers just work with that thing, and I'm, I'm not sure which ones do exactly. Because somehow I got my Logitech to work with my PS3 uh, at one point. I don't know how the fuck I did that. Okay, that's, it. that's kosher. Like, it was quite bizarre. I mean, it was cool, but it was bizarre. I got one of those F, uh, F-13s, I think it is, 113s or something, or F-310s or whatever. Thor, I'm glad to see you. What happened when you fell? Fell? Fell from what? I've been here the whole time, waiting for you to leave cyberspace. I left it a while ago. Dave. You've been in your sorceress trance a long time. Tis true. That explains much. I'm back where I started. Tis sorcery, I tell you. Ghosts befoul this place. Odin is with us. The oh shit, we'll see where it's closing. God damn it. I mean, I'll let Thor do this. Yeah, if Thor wants to get involved with the uh, explodey ones, he can go on ahead. Not to sneeze. It's really? I screwed my camera all up when I because <laughs> I was trying to go like this. I was trying to direct myself with one hand, but it wasn't working. Structure. It seems that the world's serpent is in excellent condition. It was built to last. Was built like a, a Sony TV. <laughs> no, Sony TV is like things like The Vizios, ironically, those things last a fucking eternity. Like, I'm still using my Vizio TV. I got this TV here, like, I don't know what model it is. But, I got this TV here, and I've had this thing for freaking ever. Eventually, I'll get a larger TV. I mean, it's still been serving me quite well. Like, I'd probably take this one and use it like a computer monitor. And here I was expecting a challenge. Yeah, the 360s, I want to try to get one of the black models, like the later Elites. Like, you know what I'm talking about. One had, like, the nice airflow on it, like the black models. Those things apparently are just built to last because the airflow on them are excellent. And those are the ones I want to get. Like, I still got the, you know, the white one sitting up there with, like, the Resident Evil 5 uh, thing on it. Oh, the faceplate. Too bad. Like that's one of the dream con like new consoles or not new consoles. One of the consoles I do want to get at some point. Like I keep I seen them like so long ago. Like the 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 black Xbox 360 models. Like they're I saw them for like forty five dollars and just the console themselves, which is all is really I would need. But. I would get one of those just so I can play all my other games I still sit in here or still have sitting here. 
Because, I mean, that one over there, I'm not sure if that one's 110% anymore. Because the other model, those models right there, like, they'll melt. Pardon me. I keep burping. Okay, nothing else. Yeah, like, they're so nice. Remember, was there a force jump to movie that came out? I don't remember anymore. I could have sworn like it was one of the sun or whatever, and I just can't remember if it ever came out or if it did. I'm just cold behind. Or it was mentioned or something. I don't even know. Like the black bottle for sure though. That one I'm going to try to see if I can find that in the future. Yeah, those things are like Cadillacs. Alright. So far... Yeah, because this Distinguished Carbon Pistols, those would be technically better because of what... what he is. Or he's his class as uh, champion. Why not? I have all kinds of crap here. Let me get rid of it. Uh, we'll break that down. Um... That's experience points gain armor, so why not? All right, two handed damage, why not? Usually, any game that gives you a little bit extra experience points is always nice, but uh, sometimes, too, it's like it's beneficial in the regard if you're going to do... Wait, was I supposed to come up here? No, I don't matter. I think the next time one of my Twitch thing... Or right, I get something from Twitch, which will be in whatever. I'll just use the money from that to try to get that Xbox. I'll at least try to just just get the console at least. Like you know, plugs and all that I'll get later. 
Because I know it's completely different from what the original model was. The original model had this big hunk and gourd. What the hell's going on here? There's enemies downstairs and I didn't know. Yes, there is. How about I be a good friend and try to help him out? That spider is so OP. Yeah, apparently Thor knows where to go. I'm gonna go follow him. Expecting a challenge. I am getting the challenge. You want to trade? I'll gladly do the uh the submissive here in this relationship. That's what it takes. I was gonna say, I'm surprised they ain't flipping them. Valkyrie's gonna get me here pretty soon. Oh, how's this audio? Is it good? Is it bad? Does it need to be improved? It seems like it's fine. Bother me not with your child's play, monster. ability to walk on water and in cyberspace. A part of the Norn description module blueprint has been discovered. And way to give me a god complex. Okay, those are boots, I was going to say. All right. Sheesh. Sheesh. Repair, repeater, repair. All right.
I'm not complaining what they're giving me. Oh, I think I could drop down there. I think I, yep, I see it. I think I oh no. Looked like it was like kinda of a little drop there. Yeah, somebody requested by the way. <laughs> somebody requested I'd play Lord of the Fallen, and I thought that I was kind of cackling for a minute. So Lord of the Fallen, I have a history of that game and it ain't positive. And <laughs> when I saw the name pop up, I was like, oh, you gotta be shitting me. And I think because they saw it on sale or something, like, I wonder if Danny played through that one. It's like, that's one of the games I will not play because I just... Mm -mm. My blood pressure goes to the moon with that game. I have to stop playing it. Like, I got... Like, mentally stressed out. I was angry. <laughs> Can't access that because I don't have that power up. Okay, what well, can let me leave? I'm missing something here. Yeah, it ain't against the person who requested it at all, but it's just like that game particularly it makes my blood pressure go high. So I, I'd rather, and I could play Dark Souls games, no problem. I have no grievance with Dark Souls games or anything like it, but that game in particular just it just makes my ass itch. So that's why I very politely I declined it, I credited the points. So I was like, no, thank you. <laughs> that's basically what I would do. If someone requests something and I can't or I won't play it. Okay, I have to keep pushing. Oh. And then raise it. Okay, we brought the ship back online. Let's head on back through the uh, little portal. Nothing of the Norns, Balder. 
that you could be taken in so completely by a single one. Heimdall should have let me kill you. I held your neck in my hands. I could have snapped it in twain. You should have. Now it's my turn to tighten the noose around your neck. He's trying to box us in. Mimir, can you do something? I'm doing all I can. We need hands, not heads. Out of the way. Action time. That's a cool name for a cyborg robot. Plot with more funnier uh, things about Xbox is like I keep thinking about it now. It's like as much as we like the 360, but she's that thing red ring. Easy, we just stopped him. This gun is just too bad. This is one game I had and I was like my guilty pleasure. The out I think it was Outriders. That kind of flopped, or well, that game flopped necessarily, but I enjoyed the hell out of it when it actually worked. Like, I know it didn't do too well, and it's not well received, but it was funny. I'll give Cor uh, Thor one hell of a credit. That motherfucker can tank. You can hang out at all the time if you want. Points in.
Okay, level 9 for that, and all the good bits. Save. Hit this thing for some loot. Boulder! He thinks he's going soft on us! Got an awesome breastplate. There's an orange. You know, how much does this bad boy cost? Like, so far, my, my takeaway from this game has been, has been, it's a straight up item management simulator. <laughs> Which is, I mean, I don't mind that. I think it's funny. Because <laughs> all I've been doing so far has just been uh, micromanaging the inventory. All right, so you need another 35. We can get a new pair of boots. How's the chest plate look? Okay, that looks pretty cool. Music on this is pretty good too. Like it has a lot of this game has a lot of positive elements to it too. Like it's not horrible. What are you doing? <laughs> Stop doing that. Ah, it fucked me all up now. I'm trying to focus on the guy and I'm trying to get a better position.
Oh, I have fucking browser still open. Oh, but I turned that off. <laughs> I heard a poop. Like, what the fuck is that? I, I forgot to have my shit open. That was on me. <laughs> I was sitting there like, what the fuck's that noise? Like, Oh, the spider? Nah, no, that's a cooldown. Got to build up by fighting shit. Like, it's kind of like one of those things you have to build up the gauge, and then once you fill up the gauge, you can use it. With the spider, it's kind of like a cooldown at the moment. Buff I've been using here is actually like, ooh, yeah. I'm buff. Ooh, he's candy. The door is a beast. You can. over there. I don't know, maybe it wasn't. The party was so fucking special. Something's coming up from up there. Oh. Oh, how about I go to this door over here? Didn't even notice it. I looked right at that door like at least three or four times. Didn't even bother thinking that was a door. I was just, oh, look at that wall over there. No, Ganny, that's a door. <laughs> he does. He's like a freaking air fryer on steroids. I'll tell you one thing, though. Ever since they came out or they reinvented the air fryer, and that was a great piece of technology. Have egg rolls whenever I want. And have egg rolls whenever I want. And, and have egg rolls whenever I want. Because I bought a lot of egg rolls. I'm probably going to regret that. Why did I buy a lot of egg rolls? 
These things are fucking good, bro. The Imperial uh, Dragon, I think it's called, or Gar Imperial Garden. The veggie ones are fucking phenomenal. Like, those egg rolls are amazing. Perfectly crispy when you put them in the air fryer. You know, get the seasoning with just like that. This is all made. Right there, all 25 of them. Huge egg rolls, too, so you get like a decent egg roll. They also have some like eight piece uh, spring rolls in there, too, so you can fuck a nose up later. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. What the hell's going on here? My immediate death, that's what's going on here. Make fucking gothic one look like a cake Oh! And gothic is a hard ass game anyway. They're good games, but damn are they hard. Like the first game, I just can't fuck with it because of the controls right now. But... I like the game just the same. Like the thing is, I love Gothic One, but the controls I just been up yelling. Like, when they come out with that game or that reboot, with the controls, or if somebody takes the original and does something with the controls where it's actually, you know, quality of life controls, that would be already on that shit. Focusing on the enemy and run like hell. Why are all being a, being a bro over here? I'm guessing with the guns, it doesn't really, really matter when it comes to... Pistols, I assumed, would have been as like their calling card, but I was, I was totally off the mark of that one. Pizza bagels are great. Burgers are all right in it. I prefer George Foreman Girl for burgers, to be honest with you, because it cooks just right. Because George Foreman, the, the George Foreman Grills, I love those just for burgers, um, but air fryers for burgers are good as well, but I just can't be fucked with that. Like, put them in that thing, because I like to look at the burger the entire time I'm cooking it, and I like to uh, steam... The, um, some cheese on top of that, usually. Youth grinder. Okay. Hit the wrong button there. Give me what I want, what I really, really want. Imperial Editor of Repair. I don't have enough. Oh crap, I've had to look at the craft cost. But yeah, pizza bagels are really good on that one. Like the personal pan pizzas from those things are pretty good too. Uh... Making yogurt with it's pretty nice. Okay, so wait, why the hell am I here? Oh, okay, now I remember the angle. 
We have to go this way. Actually, it's been a while since we looked at what we have for weapons currently. We got that, which is pretty nice, but we're going to break these down. Okay, that's 22. Oh, the armor bonus. That's why there's a bonus there. Gotcha. Like the gear score or the armor score went down a bit. I was like, how the hell did that happen? But then I looked again. I was like, it's a total bonus for all the armor you're wearing. Yeah, that game seemed like he was yawning at it because it was too easy. It is a shame it has come to this place. Like, it was way too easy for him to handle. Like, he kind of was just shitting through it. He's like, oh, this looks so easy. And he kept saying it, too. He's like, this is too easy. Like, he seemed disappointed. It seemed like he was having fun, but he was disappointed. <laughs> What's to expect? He's uh, rather hoping for a hard challenge. You know how he is with his games. That he likes, if the thing ain't kicking his butt a couple times, he's not happy. It was cool to see him kick through that game a bit as long as I was looking. Yeah, he just, he was eating that game for lunch, like. <laughs> he was enjoying, you could tell he was liking it, but he was, it seemed like he was bummed out how easy it was. He was like, oh, okay, yeah. <laughs> he was kind of over it, but he was. Kind of like, you'll probably play the game in the future and probably kick it up the hardest difficulty you can find. Okay, that was a snack. Other games I see him play, like, they, those are games that give me hard, like, give me a lot of trouble. Like, there's certain dungeon crawlers, like, uh, he'll be going right through them like they're nothing. But for me, I'm, like, sweating the entire time. Like, oh, shit, this is fucking hard. He's just like, oh, you know. <laughs> like, he don't, he don't even give a damn. Like, he's like, this game's supposed to challenge me? <laughs> oh, god damn it. Oh, yeah, yeah, that one's fucking hard. I saw his tweet for that one. I was like, <laughs> nice knowing your soldier. <laughs> I have that one, and it is not kind. It's a good game, but it's not kind. I have to actually finish that one. I was enjoying the hell out of it, but I never got a chance to finish it. It runs a little choppy in my computer as well, so if I played it again or I could pick it up again, I'd probably do it on a console version of the game like that. Or get a console version of the game. Awesome game otherwise, like really phenomenal, but... Yeah, like, from what I got in, into the game, uh, spoiler free, but it was like I loved it, but I couldn't play more of it because it was, like, too choppy, at least on my computer. Oh, 
Hmm. Yeah, there you go. I was hoping it was uh, gonna launch me. But. Yeah, because my list, I actually have a list here. If you do exclamation point, um, coming soon, or exclamation point coming soon. Excuse me. Um, like, the list there is going to be growing over time, but it's games I'm going to be trying to play on stream here. Like, there's going to be a couple modern ones I'm going to be playing over, like, just because I just want to play them. So it's like I'm thinking on Wednesdays I could possibly do that in February. Because again, it's going to be a temporary extra day I'm going to be doing stuff. It's being ready set, I won't be able to play, uh, at least uh, get to hang out with each other as much as we want to. So I'm just going to basically just take the extra day for now. And then once we're stable enough to hang out, pick a day where I can relax and she can relax. And, They're like, holy crap. Let's put some points in. Uh, do I want to put in that one? No. You go level 10 for the attack speed. The reason I'm going into attack speed again, because I'm using heavier weapons, it's a lot nicer to be able to swing a, a heavy ass sword super fast, so you get more ticks per attack or per you know per combo. So the more faster you do in this, there, um, you can basically just mow down things. Another 10k. Some other stuff over here, it looks like. Okay, it doesn't look like anything. Challenge room, it seems. You see how I'm able to attack a lot quicker too? It makes it a lot easier for the engagements. The slower I'm attacking, the le more likely I'm going to keep getting hit. The more likely I keep getting hit, the more I keep going down. This little robot is MVP. This is spider. Definitely MVP. Exactly. Damn, damn, MVP. Is that my total money? Or is that how much I'm getting? I, I ain't reading that correctly. Or I am not reading that correctly. Oh, it's how much I got total. Okay. Don't mind me. I'm just reading shit wrong. I'm giving myself a like, positive reinforcement. Like, yeah, I'm getting 10k. And I'm looking again going, yeah, look at that same amount. And I looked again. I was like, wait a minute. I ain't that fucking good. That's what that's going on.
Now we good. Now we're not. I never ever want to see what my death counter is in this game. Or at least acknowledge it. Well, no, I mean, the splash got me, but it was like, <laughs> I don't ever want to see my. <laughs> yeah, I was like at least this much away from the thing, but I'm just going to rule it out as I was a little too close. Like, I would just accept I was a little too close to him. I'll be the grown-up here in this situation. Even though I don't want to. Hopefully this doesn't reset. Oh man, it, it ain't gonna let me go back through there. Oh, that is so fucked up. Let me start putting the blue weapons in out of dissect or salvage.
this guy when he's going down. Ah, oh, let me tag the other arm parts. Take it, Ethor. I'll just sit back and let you two fuck it up. Just saying. Rose would have it out. Stop you. moniker. <laughs> Fuck, a sword is putting on a fucking clinic on the other guy. Yeah, I do. Pretty big hoss there. It's not so easy to juggle. I can't target this one over here. He's regular, that's good. Like, by the way, all right. What supposedly is damage here? Okay, the gloves need to be uh, fixed. Can't prepare them here yet, so.
There we go. <laughs> I don't give a damn what he dropped. He's gone. Yeah, I got rid of that fucker. I was, <laughs> I didn't care. Like, oh, you're going off the ledge now. I don't give a shit. Get out of here. <laughs> I have to go to tears afterwards and just repair everything. And here I was expecting a challenge. There we go. If I was lucky enough or got fortunate enough, I could probably. Damn, Thor was putting in that work on him. You know, we got a general captain dude here for the Dark Elves. Okay, next level we get that. Okay, that's actually a lot better. Not too expensive either. Hmm. Okay, that's actually a nice pair of gloves. The boots we got away for. Those are 22, though. No worries.
expecting a challenge. I'm gonna use that health, but that's all right. <laughs> okay, there we go. It was not like the health pellet. I was like excited in my head, like. It was like sense of relief and then the disappointment came in. That's when I knew all shit was about to go down. Okay, I need 35. go um Get health, get calm. Do your worst, Loki. I will face anything and everything you can muster. Make you wanna jump, jump, jump. Makes you wanna jump, jump. Okay, it looks like that was all this area was, just a little secret. Ah, Thora. Will your oafishness ever be realized by your ragged brain? Or will you continue to wallow in aggrandized egotism? Mimir. Hell no. I like to move it, move it. Ooh. I'm getting all set here pretty soon. Actually, let me see what I got for gear. See if we can sell anything or break anything down. You know, we are making these tough choices. Yeah. 
<laughs> okay, we got that equipped. Okay, we got 38. Wham bam bloom the bam 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 boom bam the bam the bam the bam bam the boom the the boom the the boom the the boom Can you hold yourself back, Lord? Can you? And the enemies will be kind of wonky because of the uh. By the way, move. Think do I set up to do those little uh, jow uh, tosses or air attacks? Fucking camera shit. camera drives me nuts. The camera got me killed. Hide a bit. Well, my mouth was screaming though the entire time. This was that. This is BS. The fuck? Where the hell am I? I will face anything and everything you can muster. I mean, if you want to... My butt is telling me no! I mean, I know the lyrics. I'm just trying to get back to this... Wham blam fucking uh, the camera's like fuck it we're gonna do some gauntlet mode I'm like god damn it camera make up the game you're trying to be <laughs> you see this shit now it's going overhead for no reason Doing shit to the camera, the camera's doing me. If 
feel like a cheap whore in the red light district over here. And here I was expecting a challenge. The meanest jaw in the fucking red light district, but boy oh boy is that camera fucking up. Gentlemen, if Gentlemen. you are searching for the exit, this is entirely the wrong way. Perhaps you should turn about and explore elsewhere. I've got many friends eager to meet you. What the fuck is going on no there? I didn't know that. You'd best be saving your best for last, because this is something of a letdown. Keep saying A being pressed. What I'm saying, give me, or keep giving me the A icon, and I keep tapping it, nothing. Yeah, everyone was like, when I. Assassin's Creed 2 came out, everyone was like, yeah! <laughs> like, that was the, the bee's knees, and then, uh, what was it, Assassin's Creed 4 kind of came out, and everyone was like, loving that game. camera stop fucking doing that <laughs> like it keeps focusing on the enemies that I don't want it to like I'm trying to go and collect shit and like I'd really appreciate if you let me do it how I need to like is there an option here for the camera like I got to know no it just tells me uh I forgot which one it was, or that everyone kind of like it was a comical kind of thing where it was just so damn buggy it was good because it was buggy. I forgot which uh, Assassin's Creed that one. One of was like really nightmare fuel. Like I don't remember what the hell that one was. Was it Rogue? No, it wasn't Rogue. I mean, all the Assassin's Creed games were buggy, but not to the point of this other game I'm thinking of. I think Rogue was a decent one. I can't remember which one it was. There was some that was like supposed to be like a co-op multiplayer and then it was just so fucking buggy. Like it was just texture tearing on the faces, you saw eyeballs and teeth and shit. It was like, I mean, I don't usually try to make fun of games, but goddamn, that was like, Jesus Christ, the fuck out <laughs> It's like just nightmare fuel. Like I don't do a comedy skit off of games at all, but it's just that one, I was like, what the hell is this? Like, it fucked me up mentally. I was like, 
I wasn't ready for that. I wasn't prepared. <laughs> Watch our friend play it out when I was like, what the fuck is going on? He goes, I don't know. They're like, they're like, I think the, what was it? They said, I think the Devel or the directors were fucking the living dead inside of taking the reins of this game, and that, and they went from there. I was like, probably, I don't know. Tis a fine day for your death, monster. Yeah, like I don't remember what the hell the game's or the name of the game is called though. Like it was Assassin's Creed something. I wasn't. I, I don't think it was Rogue. Cause I think Rogue was kind of like the niche favorite, or it could also be the Rogue. And I'm just thinking of a totally wrong one because there's so many fucking Assassin's Creed now. I can't tell you. Uh, barely half of them from one another. Like Origins and all that, okay, I can tell you that much, but after a while, it, it just, my brain gets fuzzy. Syndicate! Okay. Like, it was notorious. I was like, what the fuck? The thing is, I don't think Assassin's Creed was a bad series at all. Like, it was kind of like I, it got kind of long in the tooth for me personally. Like, I liked seeing other people play it and were having fun. I just, after the first and second and fourth game, I was kind of like, okay, I'm all set. Uh, Origins, I can't really play on my computer, so even though I own it, so it's one of those games where I'll wait till it gets super cheap on Xbox One or something. Or on PS4 or whatever platform I see it on. Okay, I got greedy. Loki, come fight me one on one. I'll show you the meaning of courage. Are you really so stupid? Oh yeah, I'm, I'm very stupid. I don't, I don't lie to anyone and tell you I'm stupid. I drag my knuckles everywhere I go. Like I'm thick eyebrow and the hand fell stupid. Just the other day, I realized that our household had running water. I was I was thrown to a fucking loop. I was like, "What the fuck is this?" The world serpent is in Loki's hands. Why did you not warn me of his deception? The information was not yours to know. We could not tell you everything, young Baldur. You must trust me. Okay. It seems like there's like an asshole of enemies here. Man is free to make his own choices. That no one's weird is set. Isn't that what you've told me? I am done with your games. Hold, like, after the core story here, I'll be moving on, but it's... Okay, ooh, there's a group. But understand, we cannot reveal too much. For fear we might unduly affect your decisions and seal the fate of the world. We can say oh, there's another one over there, too, shit. Are the Christmas rare. damn day over here. But yeah, I actually loved it when they gave us, uh, what was it, Horizon for free on the X or PS, I guess it was Xbox for a second there. Uh, I mean, I did, but <laughs> but on the PS4 when they would tell us to stay at home or whatever, and they're like, stay at home and play some fucking Horizon Zero Dawn, I'm like, thanks for the freebies, thank you. <laughs> I can't install it right now, my hard drive's tiny, but thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get a new hard drive for the PS4 at some point. Even we do. Thor, I think it's Thor doing some fucking. If we don't leave now, we never will. We will be crushed by the pressure. This entire vessel is being flooded for ballast. Fool, this beast cannot be allowed to escape. It must be destroyed. There you go. Not allow it to be used against us. Mimir is right. We are worth more to the Aesir alive, Thor. Humanity needs us. We need to warn the Aesir of Loki's deception. Worry not. I will inform them myself in person when I wake. Your fear soaks your armor. I can smell it. You're afraid to die. I will not die a useless death. Destroying this thing at the cost of our own lives weakens the Aesir's hand. 
It is pointless. I suggest we choose a course of action sooner rather than later. Uh, you will sing of your cowardice in Asgard. But if you prefer a life of shame to a glorious death, it will be released. What depth is your armor rated for? At least 5,000 meters. Well, Enemies everywhere. At least one of us will make it to the surface. <laughs> Party tricks, see if I can equip anything. Mm, not a bad weapon. Not a bad one either. Alright, we'll goof with it. Auto Savage Blue, though. That. Break that down. Wait, why did they give me such a weak weapon? That's a two handed, yeah. Damn, that's a weak sauce weapon. I mean, it has some decent little stats in there, but... I'll craft that. Heck, even this pistol's better. Oops. Meant to do this. He's down. We'll slot these real fast. That's a huge, that's a great rune there. Unity. Loki, you'd best be saving your best for last, because this is something of a letdown. Okay, I got too cocky. I should have just kept shooting. I was over seeing Thor do his thing. I'm like, yeah, I'm going to be like Thor. Yeah. Do your worst, Loki. I will face anything and everything you can muster. Yeah, because hypothetically the pistol is supposed to be better for me, but they're not so better. Like the rolling up all those stats with the pistol just felt worthless. Like I was better off just using something else. Huh. Tis 
but a kiss from a baby. Ba, 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 ba. Wham, ba, 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 blam, wham, blam, blam. Well. See, it took that thing down like it was butter, but this damn fucking boss here, he's beating some ass. Oh, okay, I see his shield now. Now I see why. Didn't notice the little be uh, thing next to his damn son, but so that means he has like a crazy ass shield. There we go. Little barbed looking lo icon next to it? That makes sense. That might be it's like resistant as fuck to everything. There we go. Oh, he's still good. Okay, wait a minute. Oh, that arm. That's gonna smart on tomorrow. Big news is up play now. That's right, Thor. You'd be the best tank ever. Take that ass whooping like a man. We'll sit at the table and I'll laugh at you for a good 20 minutes. Like, <laughs> lo, 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 lo. That's a good shit here. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That's some good stuff. Yeah, PlayStation or the PlayStation 5 is a, a curious creature. At least from the horror stories I've heard about it. Like, I don't have one, but just I've been hearing horror stories about the thing, and it's at this point now, you're just like, why the hell are they so restrictive on shit? This place is pretty. All right, Soul Assassin, rest thee well. Loki, come fight me one on one. I'll show you the meaning of courage. So much easier with these pistols now, these little guys.
I will face anything and everything you can muster. Fuck is that thing? Jesus. Skills. All right. Um, Break that down. That's technically better than what I just had just now, but. Can't break that down. Tax speed on those were nice, but not really useful in the long run. Very right, next level for those. Okay. a giant against us? Nay, lad. This is not a giant. At least not a Yoden. It's some kind of troll variant. Sign of Loki's desperation. <sighs> What's nice about these pistols too, they actually they hit multiple enemies at once. I confused at first, I'm like, why the fuck? I was targeting two things at first, I wasn't truly really paying attention, but then I looked again, I'm like, oh! That's actually pretty cool. That makes the pistols really useful. For crowd control.
Smash? Damn it. I didn't even press the analog stick. Alright, we can fight the whole fucking thing over again. Oh no, we good. Okay. You are defeated, Loki. We have destroyed all you have pitted against us. Defeated. I have only just been. Beast is diving. Loki's flooding the interior as ballast. <laughs> He'll wipe out all of the trolls. The trolls won't care about the water. They were built with this thing. That's what they were made for. We need to leave. There's little collectibles in the corners there, but fuck it. Sons of Loki, your master calls upon you. In these dark times, your help is needed. Loki can't open this door through cyberspace. It's a manual release. Get it open! Your sacrifice will bring about the twilight of the gods and a new age. I trust you have brought my weapon and armor as you commanded, my lord. <laughs> I think I need to stretch my legs. Take him down!
Our troops are securing the shuttle bays. Let us make haste, then. You have done well, brothers. You shall not be forgotten. Die well, and make the Aesir remember this day. Wow. He got the hell out of Dodge. Weapon blueprints. Uh, so we got the weapon store. Not bad. Like some of these weapons are just like stupidly strong as hell, but they're kind of expensive. Woo wee! That's a nice weapon. I, mean, I could technically sell this one. Where are these white ones? To save our money. Through Loki's treason. Perhaps we shall continue to do this. They stormed right. 
right down this hallway. I know. I was almost killed. Okay, near the feasting hall. collectible there, but nothing really. They've called every Azir for some kind of emergency meeting. Every Azir? Okay, that, that makes it easier. to the chalice room here and go to the meeting room and have a conversation too. You men have been tried and convicted of treason against the Aesir. For a mortal man there can be only one sentence. What do you think about dying? I am well with it. For when I die here at your hand, the example I set will not be the one you intend. Are you well with your death, traitor? I am well with it. As all of us are. I shall not be slaughtered. <laughs> Loki is now our most dangerous enemy. It is reasonable to assume he has fled to Helheim to take refuge with his daughter. Aye, if Hel gives refuge to Loki, then surely she is our enemy. Has Hel shown us any hostility? No, we are the aggressors in this. Loki just We cannot afford to fight a war on two fronts. We are barely holding our own on one. Why sit idly by while she amasses her forces? War must be taken to them both, and delivered in heaps. Justice War must be this served. Is so I shall not let tolerated. Loki make a mockery of us. Have my children lowered themselves to petty bickering? Loki must be found and punished, along with all those who side with him. There are many omens that portend a bloody war. Brothers will be drenched with their brother's blood. I will not shed a tear for those who stand against us. We are the warm breezes that melt the ice. We shall free the world from cold stagnation. We have a vision, a single purpose. And by our hand, humanity shall live. We are the Azir. The All-Father has spoken, and our path made abundantly clear. Steal yourselves, as war is upon us once again. How long, do you think? For what? Before they turn on us, the humans. Never. Bragi does his job well. We have protected them so long that they only know us as their protectors. Lords and masters. They cannot turn against us. They don't know how. Every day their world diminishes, and we are unable to bring it back. They cannot be completely unaware of what is lost. So little is left. But what is left is important, Frey. Without us, humans have no purpose. We define them. But how long before they realize that there is no hope? How long before they realize that we cannot restore what they have lost? Hope? With a leader yeah. like Odin, there is always hope, brother. 
You do well to remember that. Like certain games, it doesn't, you know, execute. Like, yeah, tongue tied. Execution wise, it's done to a, you know, like a fine tooth comb. With a warrior's like resolve. with God of War, you know, fine tooth comb. With this, it's kind of like, yeah. <laughs> lost their respect in that hall. It is a sad day when you lament, Frey, and I'll hear no more of it. A man without hope is one thing. A god without it is unthinkable. Perhaps you doubt my courage as Thor does. I do not, Frey, but I do question your faith in yourself as one of us. The end is coming, Heimdall. Then let it come. We shall meet it with weapons in hand and joy in our hearts. Our lives belong to Odin. I'm all sitting here eating nachos and shit. Just <laughs> all this shit going down. But I was actually trying out, uh, I was checking to see how fresh this is. Like, I opened up the bottle for the Louisiana and the Texas Pete to see. Because this one, I haven't seen this before with these bottles. Or I haven't gotten a bottle of uh, Texas Pete in a hot minute. Pardon the pun. But, basically, it has this really nice cap to it. But they got fancy as fuck. Shit, that's why I forgot to buy. I forgot to buy french fries. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah, exactly. Get the Galahorn, just solo the whole fucking raid. Just get it going. Wrap this shit up. And then go to the docking bay. Is it bad that I'm almost excited that this game's over, though? <laughs> like, it's sort of like I... I don't feel like I'm having as much fun as I was originally at first. I'm like, oh yeah, this ain't too bad. Now I'm playing it, and near the end, I'm just kind of like... I'm kind of over this now. I want this to end. <laughs> it's like I'm disappointed, but I didn't pay a nickel for it, so I can't be that upset about it. Like, this was given away for free for, you know what I mean, for Xbox One, Xbox S, X players. So it's not a, you know, not like I got fucked over here. Like, I paid, I think I did buy this, though. I can't remember. Like, I keep thinking I have a copy of this physically, but I can't remember anymore. So I'd have to go through my collection and actually sort through it. I keep thinking this is the exit. Not anymore. Like, it just feels like kind of like a chore to play it. Like, I want to finish it out of principle, but then my brain's like, you know, Daniel, you see what's in front of you, right? And I'm like, ah, and my ADHD side of my brain's like, you know, you could be playing that right there, right? And I'm like, ah, uh -huh. you know, and I'm just sitting, keep glaring at the case of this while I'm playing the game. And I'm just like going, I want to play the shit out of that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yes, that game could be, have its fair share of trolliness, but fuck do I have fun in that one. Like, this is my first time fully engaging in Too Human, but then it's like, if I would have bought this day one when this came out, I'd probably been very pissed off. And so it is with a solemn heart that I must urge the Aesir to war. An assault on Helheim is no small task, brethren. Oh, there's our hell hive. There it is. We can wrap it up, boys.
It's like with. Ah. Farewell, daughter. May we meet again in some later life. After this world is turned to rubble, and the green we miss so much takes on. Damn, I fucking realized that was his daughter. You know how bad that is. That is passed between these walls. Will be thrown upon my pile, father. Like my mythology must be totally the fuck off here. And they will fight for us once more. Like in the story, she just showed up, and I thought she was part of the fucking. Um, he is now our most dangerous enemy. The thing there. Fight. What the hell kind of fever dream is this shit? It's not like the Borg, it sounds kind of cool though. The like this part's kind of cool. I'm not gonna Borg fight any of the fighting though. What you think too is like this game has like such cool ass aesthetic right there's like so many positive little elements that you can look at and you know everything looks great right like this game looks absolutely phenomenal but I feel like it just the story went took a nosedive some at some point because I didn't know what who the fuck that girl was I was looking at the dialogue and everything I was trying to take in as much as I could but the story was like I need a new body that girl's tits look great and then she got a new boob job or something and that's all I knew about that and then after that I didn't know who the fuck she was anymore like I had to literally go probably go read a book and go look up the mythology to figure out who the fuck she was and I'm, again I hate pushing down games or punching down on games if I'm not having fun with them but it's just like my critique of the game story is it's hot ass like the, the gameplay at points if it the game decides it wants to behave itself it's you know fine but then the jankiness of the camera it fucks me over every time because after a while i start mellowing into it i'm like okay i could deal with this shit okay all right this ain't bad but then it's like it's like a like a fucking abusive friend you're trying to get along with but they keep punching you in the face right and you don't want to hang out with that friend anymore if they keep punching you in the face now, who the fuck wants to deal with that? I'll pretty soon I'll be sat yelling at clouds here, but shit. Papa Dan needs to lick his wounds. Alright, so that's already capped out. Reload speed would be nice. Let's start working on this stuff here. This tree, I'll probably do stuff here. I'm not sure yet. That's a battle cry. I bet you if I would have... Hold on. Hold on. Okay, this tree is completely fine, so I'll leave that alone. I'll do Raven's Call. Leave that at two for now. Yeah, the juggle, even the juggling in this, right? I'd probably go with that. I feel like you just need to focus on one tree to even do anything. Exactly. It's like you don't even need to fucking worry about pissing somebody off anymore because you're like, shit. Rub their belly, give them some ice cream, and you're a friend now. And then they keep punching you. Uh, 
And it's like this one here, it's like I, I see positive elements of it. Like if they were to somehow magically out of the heavens themselves. You know, okay, that simplest solution anything, you shoot it down. Love it. I like things like that. I don't need to use my brain. No, I love using my brain in certain games. It's like no ego there, but I just like it. I like things that challenge me a little bit with puzzles. And everything. Those are, they're fun little puzzles. You know what I mean? Like in Jedi fucking Fallen Order, or Jedi Fallen Order. See, much better. Look at that. They're doing the thing. You know, and I think we're literally at the end of the game here, so at least for the story. And it's like, from this point, after this, I'm not touching no more content. <laughs> like, that's, that's, that's the hallmark, that's the uh, calling guard. Because, I mean, I've gotten this far, I might as well finish it. Which leads to that kind of thing where I'm out of principle now. It was like when I was playing that Ghost Warrior 3, I think it was. That game was not good. Like, it was not good at all. And so... I was like, okay, I have to beat this game out of principle now. And it was like, it wasn't good. Like, the majority of the weapons were useless. Sniper rifles in that game, you had only one weapon out of the entire lot of them, and it was actually pretty good. Like, the sniper bits were decently fun, but after that, you were just, there was nothing else to really give a shit about in that game. Like, the exploration was alright. Like, I like the exploration in that game. Because you have nice little worlds you can kind of... Or terrain you can kind of run around and explore in, and that wasn't too shabby. So again, it was like little bits and pieces I liked to it. But then the rest of it was just like... The story was bad. You know, and that's kind of how I'm feeling with this one. It's like, it's still... There's little quality elements. I bet you any money, if you played this online, it was probably, like, amazing. This is probably the best shit you ever played in your life. Yo, know, and it's definitely probably a lot more fun with other players and... It just felt like it was a game that was built to be a multiplayer game. Like, and that's not, there's nothing wrong with it. I mean, I don't just play single player games all the time, but it's like when you play a multiplayer game, that's, you have to play a multiplayer game that has to be single player at this point in time. You just have feeling it and you're like, you know, things feel off. Like, you need that balance. Not your handheld, but just more balance to what you're you're doing in the game. Because it just makes more sense. You know, when you're playing Among Us by yourself, you're not really doing much in Among Us, because you're, you're literally the part of the killer or the survivor, and there's no one else there. But the way the game's built, you're always playing with somebody just about. I mean, there's nothing wrong to play with yourself, but you can't... After a while, you get bored. Like, so far, this area, it has, like, that nice meat potato vibe to it. Like this epic drawing, which is nice, right? This this part ain't too bad. There's like a lot going on, but there's not too much going on where it's just overwhelming. The one enemy is just chilling here. I'm not even gonna fuck with him. I, I respect his game. He's just chilling, see? Look at him. He's just cheering his buddies on, just rocking his axe. He's like, fuck it. I can't be mad at him either. He's just sitting there. I'm not gonna fuck with him either. I'm just leaving him alone. Unless it's like he's blocking me off from going forward, then yeah, I'll take him out, but... Oh, he looked fun. Oh, 
This mechanic came out of left field. This part right here gives me like that total four like 40k vibe to it, which is like again that's I'm actually liking this because it reminds me of that. I'm like, oh yeah, okay. What the fuck with this? I'm a fan of zombie games anyway, too. Like I don't go out of my way to play them all the time, but when I get my hands on one, I'm like. It seems like it's better, since I re-rolled the tree a little bit and went straight down the middle, it seems like it's better now. Maxed out on the pistol. Alright, I think I have to move forward and nothing's gonna happen. See if there's any items over there. I think I saw something. Or I bought it. What? <laughs> Those zombies the Bob are like, Good. Good thing we have good insurance. He said it, Gus. Everything. Odin 
man's beard. That's all right. What do we got here? Insert that. Okay, for blueprints. All right, so I decided to give us some not so great items. There we go. Break that down. down. That's better than what I have. Alright. Gas pollution. We'll get the whole uh, buster. Well, kind of like a green version of it, but you get it. This is the afterlife. For those not far enough to fight it on the time at this place. You barely broke a sweat. We got blood sweat out of every pore. This shit. Nice. I'm gonna use him like uh, Nova. Jesus Christ, you boys hit. Yeah, definitely like a uh, range. You know, you're in range.
We're going slow motion. skills were so sick it made me cheat. Oh. oh shit. Went off the cliff. I've got a bad feeling about this place. You and everyone else. This is a place for the dead. Not for us. Be careful. This will be the last place you see. I got him. What's that? A statue. It is hell, mistress of this realm. That is evidence of her arrogance and excess. The whore has no values. She is devoted only to herself. But she's hell. Meaning resistance. Light resistance. Glory shines upon us. Damage moderate. The lunge is not so high with this weapon. What the? And their spike damage is vicious. On a side note, the uh, Lunar, by the way, the online co-op or couch co-op with that is actually pretty damn good. Me and uh, Ready Set were goofing Dash, that. Minimal. That shit was flawless. Like, I had no frame drops, nothing. It's sad that no one brings it up more often because that's actually a pretty nice uh, feature. So if one person or one friend has Lunar or Luna, and if you have, like, I think Amazon Prime, I think you could technically play the game for free. With somebody else if you wanted to. With the uh, couch claw. I think that's how it works. Because, like, uh, Prime users do get access to certain games for a short window, but. I just thought it was pretty wild. I can't tell the difference between the blower uppers and the nodders. If they don't, then I don't know. Because I can't tell. Some of them are red, you'd be like, oh, okay, just ready. And then the fucker blows up on you. Oh, shit. Okay, that one's a slow one. So I'm going this way. Wait a minute. I think I see one. Good. Enough for everyone. Isometric. This whole fucking time I can admit it. Completely nice or maybe you
This is much better. <laughs> Much better now. And our robot don't fuck around. Blow things up. Playing it very carefully. That was no battle. Permission to fire, sir. I'll oh, go out ahead. I don't care if you fire. Stun there on that slow. That began as we wrap up here. Thinking Wednesdays and Friday night, what we we'll probably play uh, starting next month. Thinking maybe cup like just play a game just randomly that like it doesn't matter what it is just whatever or even just make that the day for indie games. It seems like those games come around that time stamp around Thursdays. Yeah, rando or I could just play games I have in my backlog or. Because usually Wednesdays are nice because I can just relax and but coming up next month, um, the race set's going to be, you know, not as available.
Okay, my brain is confused by the camera. Fuck this. There we go. Black out. 